We found this antique dresser on Facebook Marketplace. It didn't come with the top two drawers and I've debated about what to do with it for like a year now, until just recently. If I removed the top two drawers, you would see that the top wasn't one solid piece. And if I kept the drawer cubbies, I would have to do something with them. But what would I do? Well, check out what I ended up doing. Just like with every furniture makeover, I got started by removing the hardware and look at the gunk behind these things. I personally don't like these poles, so they aren't going back on. Then I removed the drawer boxes on the top and cleaned what was left of the dresser. We sanded all of the gunk off of the drawers, filled in the scratches, fixed the keyhole, and filled in the old hardware holes. Then we cut a new top for the dresser, messed up, and had to cut off more. Then we added some detailing to the edges. And then we attached the new top to the dresser with some glue and brad nails. I filled the nails in the knots with some plastic wood filler and then let everything dry before sanding it all down. I brushed and rolled some black primer onto the dresser, hoping to fill in the open wood grain that I created by sanding the drawers down to raw wood in some spots and to fill in any open wood grain texture on the top. When the primer was dry, I could still see some wood grain texture on the drawers where I had sanded down to bare wood so I filled those spots in with some wood filler and let it dry overnight. The next day I sanded everything down smooth, cleaned up the dust and primed again for good measure. Then I sprayed two coats of Lily Moon all-in-one paint in the color Wilderness. I thinned it out with about 20% water to get a really nice smooth texture. And when it was dry, I drilled holes and put new hardware on. And here is what it looks like now. I absolutely love this color. Isn't it such a good shade of green? Overall, I love the new look. The details on the side of the dresser stand out more now, and I think it looks so much better without the drawers on the top. What do you think of the new look? Let me know in the comments. Are you confused and not sure where to start with your furniture makeover? Don't worry, I got your back. Click the link in my comment to download our free painting checklist so you can paint your furniture as if you hired a professional to do it.